So most of the time we get notified of a positive case in a family and the virus tends to spread in, in a close family setting and has around a 20-25% attack rate within, within that setting. Uh, so if we get notified of a positive test in, in a family, we would then offer testing to all family members whether they have symptoms or not. If there's a child that then subsequently tests positive that had symptoms or didn't, we go basically two days before the, the test date or before the symptoms develop uh, and we consider anyone that was exposed to that child as a high risk, especially if they were, they were within two meters of that individual uh, and, and not wearing masks. Uh, and so we would then work with the school uh, uh, to do a risk assessment and, and it's our final decision of that risk and we would try to look at uh, what exposures that child had in the class or in the school. Uh, if there was an exposure, we, we've been very conservative. Uh, we've we've uh, told classes to go home uh, and if there was any sympt anyone symptomatic in that class, we would offer testing to those individuals. Uh, and. Uh, if there were a number of people uh, symptomatic, we would test the whole school, typically five to seven days after the exposure, because that's when you have the greatest uh, uh, reliability of the testing. And we, we at KFLA do clearance testing at day 10, uh, and 97.5% per uh, of people convert uh, to a positive test by day 10 if they're going to convert. So that gives us very good confidence uh, that we've caught most of the potential exposures secondary to a classroom. If there has been no exposure, so the child wasn't at the, in the school within a couple of days of developing symptoms, um, we won't deem any exposure, but there will be a notification to the school that there was a, a child that, uh, that was at that school, but not a high risk exposure, and we'll ask everyone to monitor their symptoms. So with this strategy, we've been able to very much limit the spread of this virus in our community. I'm confident with this strategy going forward. Uh, and it's worked, worked well to continue to protect our schools uh, during this difficult environment.